Hi, Hi, this Linda. is Gloria. I'm Gloria. This is Jane. Oh, we got a lot of the message today. I uh, have so many inquiries asking about Chinese name. So yes. that's why then we pick up some uh, candidates it's today. Just... Maybe we can offer them a better Chinese name. Yes. Okay. First, we have Lena Viva for for tea. No, like... She loves butterfly. Maybe we'll pick from some of the traditional Chinese literatures, like the Book of Songs, and we have a story relating to butterflies. Zhuang Shang Xiao Meng Mi Hu Die. His name is Zhuang Shang, oh, yeah. and he had a dream, and in his dream that shows a lot of butterfly. Shang is like knowing. Meng means dream. Butterfly yeah, in Chinese yeah. is called Hu Die. So I'm thinking about using Xiao Meng as her Chinese name. Yeah, that's a good name. That's a good name. Yeah. We'll also uh, give you a family name of Fu Die. That's right. Uh, we'll, yeah. we'll give you uh, similar pronunciation. Fu. Together will be Fu Xiao Meng. It's really nice name. Yeah. Next we have Agavelli May de la Cruz. Cruz. <laughs> so can we call you May for short? May is a lovely female lady who loves moon. So for May, we have Chu Xian for her. And in the yeah, moon calendar, Chu Xian means like the new moon. New moon. New yeah. moon. Yeah. So it also comes from a really popular, it's popular poem from, from famous. a famous poet it's called Du Fu in Tang du Dynasty. Yun Yan Chu Xian Yue. Yun it's the cloud just covered the new moon, so it shows a really beautiful thing, right? Uh, uh, yeah. uh, it's relating to moon, but it's not really straightforward. Uh, it's more like re relating to our traditional roots. And yeah, it's, it's like metaphorical, yeah, like the clouds covering the moon and just yeah. showing you the good stuff behind all the <laughs> cover rooms, you know. Like, we also think of like the direct sound of it, moon. It just sounds like moon. Do you love my Chinese name? Uh, okay, next. Okay. So we picked this guy called uh, Mr. Yeah. Kenwa. Uh, he's 26 years old of age and uh, he wants his name to be related to, to a king. Okay. So what will we name him? Uh, I did a lot of research actually. So in Chinese, the emperor, we call them the ministers or other levels of, uh, you know, people who serve them, who, who works with, uh, for them, we call them Chen, right? Jun Chen. Chen. So I'm thinking about using Jun in your Chinese name and uh, Bai, Bai Shu the Bai, the because um, the San Francisco is like straight, um, straight and, and uh, huge. Yeah, it's also kind uh -huh. of like a symbol of the uh, emperor. Of tough, tough. Or if you don't have, have a family, family name, you can use Wang like family name because Wang also means mm -hmm. emperor, right? Yeah. yeah, I think it's a really cool name. Uh, Wang Jun Bai. There's a cute girl, only 18 years old, and her name is Deborah, and Deborah. she she didn't Deborah. ask for anything like a very detailed requirement, but. We checked her uh, Facebook ID. It's uh -huh. like a, a very cute Japanese cartoon door. So well, maybe she's into more of like a younger vibe. So we are thinking about giving her a cute name. Uh -huh. So I'm thinking about Jami. 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 There's a uh, Chinese poem right. called right. Jami Yong Yang, Zhu Mi Yu Xi. It really doesn't matter if you don't understand because we don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> this name is cute. Uh, it sounds, sounds really cute. cute. Yeah. So Debbie, let us know if you like Jami or not. If not, then. Probably we'll think. deal with it. <laughs> well, yeah, we're gonna deal with that. You're we'll, gonna we'll be responsible for that. We have a 16 years old girl here who likes to smile, and her name is Hayati Boy. I'm thinking about using Qingcheng as your Chinese name. Because um, there's a saying called Yi Xiao Qingcheng. Qingcheng means the whole city. Fall for, falls for you. Yeah, because you're uh -huh. so beautiful. Especially when you smile, the whole city falls. It's kind of like mm, that. I mm, love that name, mm, actually. Mm, and, and she could have the last name of Luo. Luo Qingcheng. Luo Qingcheng. Yeah. Because uh, you're her so actual... talented, yeah. Gloria. <laughs> uh. His name is Kim. Regatta. And her old Chinese teacher gives her a name of Lai Jing <laughs> Lai Jing Di. And she asks, <laughs> really bad. should I get a new one or is it a good name? But definitely. definitely you need <laughs> yeah, girl. Name. Get a new name. Lai Weijia. Lai Weijia. Yeah, I think it's better, Kim. Yeah, try, try this, try this new name. Yeah, but it doesn't have a lot of stories behind this name. It just mm -hmm. sounds good. Yeah, like my name, Gloria. <laughs> this one, uh, Nasri and Ali, she twenty is three years old. Female. Uh, and, and she's very fond of white flowers symbol for purification uh, so i'm thinking about which white flower also can represent purification uh, like uh, lily like lily in chinese bai he. Bai he is flower uh, this means uh -huh. lily yeah i'm not very sure if you like this so i give you another option called ling lan so that's it for today tell me more about your like chinese name in korean look forward to talking to you soon see you bye soon bye, bye.